<laughs> good answer. Good question. Good answer. Easy, easy question. They found they found happiness. <laughs> I might do it again, but I would say over a longer period or just take take more time in each country. I, I want to go back to all the places and spend more time there. So I promise I like to go where I want to go. The scene I want to see. So if I were to like that, I want to do it on my own time. You would change something. Well, I, I want to be able to, if I like a place, I want to stay. You know, that's how I ended up in Germany. If I like a place, I want to stay. If I don't like a place, I want to leave. You know, like, in this way, you have to leave at this time, you have to leave at this time. That's not for me. And there's so many places where we discover such special stuff. So we really have to take our hearts out by leaving. And I'd like to be able to stay. You know, I'd like to be able to say, hey, you know what? Serbia is great. I want to spend a couple of weeks here. Go see the countryside. Go see the mountains. Go see, you know, go see things. But if somebody was paying me, I'd probably still would do it all. I, I think I would need more than a week. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Give me a month. Month, okay. Can't just you both. Would you like to see in your hometown? To see everything. Be it a monument, the seaside, uh, a person, anything. Things that we miss? What are the things that you picked up around the world that you would like to have in the city? <laughs> There was a kebab I had in Serbia. <laughs> if they could make this shit in my hometown, that would be awesome. Uh, if the they could have the, the club in uh, Colombia called Andres Candeles in my hometown, I would be happy. <laughs> it's a famous, famous place. What's the name of the place? Andres. Andres. Just remember Andres. Everyone in all the other countries in South America, when we were saying, they were like, when are you going to Colombia? Oh, next week. You have to go to Andres. Anyone who has ever been to Colombia knows it. That's like the landmark. What's the, what's the catch about it? It's just the awesome. It's awesome. It's great fun. Unadulterated fun. You can go there on a Sunday night and people will be dancing in the salsa on the dance floor. And, uh, it's good. Beautiful music. Everybody's free and willing to dance and free stuff up. Like nobody has restraints. It's not like you have to. Oh, nobody's dancing. Like everybody's out there, like just trying to have fun. And there's a lot of Coke everywhere. I mean, <laughs> Coca Cola, Coke like. There's Coca Cola everywhere. Uh, what else would I have in DC? I would have. The rainforest. The rainforest of Ecuador. In DC, definitely. And the last thing I that would make it a little tough to get to the capital, wouldn't it? Yeah. The last thing I would have in DC is I would take the women from the former Yugoslavia and all of the countries. <laughs> and I would make them. And leave us with what? <laughs> Penises. Uh, Easter eggs. <laughs> Easter eggs. Uh, <laughs> Yeah, I'm sorry. I was beep, beep, beep. Yeah, I was still all of the way. And also the mentality. Alright, anyone else? You got any questions for us? Yes. Okay, I'll stop.